we have infinity in upper limit. So first we will convert the integral to a limit. So this is equal limit. We can replace infinity with variable t. So it will be t goes to positive infinity. And we have now in definite integral from 1 to t of dx over 4x squared plus a. So now we have to solve this definite integral. So it means first we have to check if our function which we integrate is continuous. We have 1 over 4x squared plus 8. This is continuous function. The numerator is different than 0 always. So let me rewrite this integral. We have 1 over 4x squared plus 8 dx. So first I will factorize 4 in the denominator. So it will be 1 over 4. I can put before integral symbol. And we have 1 over x squared plus 2 dx. Next step, because we have x squared plus constant number 2, so I have to do everything to get integral of x squared plus 1 with respect to x. This is equal to tangent of x. So we will do substitution method to solve this integral. I will put that x is equal square root of 2u. Why I put square root of 2? Because I need to factorize this 2. So let's look what we will have. Now we have to find derivative of both sides with respect to x. So we will have dx is equal square root of 2du. And we will have 1 over 4 we have to copy. Now we have 1 in numerator x we will substitute by square root of 2u we have x to second power so we have to put and we have plus 2 d u and square root i will put before integral symbol so we have 1 times square root of 2 so this is equal we have square root of 2 over 4 integral of 1 over 2 u square plus 2 du. So this is equal. Next, I will factorize 2 in denominator. So we will have square root of 2 over 4 times integral of 2 times u square plus 1 in denominator and 1 we have in numerator du. So this is equal. 2 we can, 1 over 2 we can take before integral symbol. So we have square root of 2 over 8. Integral of 1 over u square plus 1 du. So this is equal, like I said, this is arc tangent. So we have to copy constant. Arc tangent. And because we substitute x by square root of 2, 2u. So now we have to come back to the substitution and our u we have to substitute by, let me find, we have to divide this both sides our equation by square root of 2. So we have x over square root of 2 is equal u. So now we have arctangent of x over square root of 2. We found our integral, so we have to come back to our limit of definite integrals we have. So we have to copy limit. T goes to positive infinity. We will copy solution, square root of 2 over 8, arc tangent of x over square root of 2. And now we have to put the we have to put the limit because we have definite integral here. So upper limit is t and lower is one. So this is equal limit t goes to positive infinity. We have to copy and now we have to plug first upper limit. So we have square root of two over eight. And let me put this in parentheses. I will have arc tangent of 
because we have here in denominator square root, we don't like square root in denominator. I will multiply numerator and denominator by square root of 2. So now we have square root of 2 over 2x. And we have to put t, of course, instead of x, because we plug upper limit. And we have minus, lower limit is 1, arc tangent square root of 2 over 2 times 1. So this is equal. We have limit. T goes to positive infinity. Let me rewrite this one more time. We have square root of 2 over 8. And in brackets we have arc tangent square root of 2 over 2 T minus arc tangent square root of 2 over 2. T goes to positive infinity. We have here arc tangent square root of 2 times positive infinity. So it will be very large number. Let me remind you the graph of arc tangent. We have this graph between this two horizontal asymptote, negative pi over 2 and pi over 2. This graph is going from negative infinity to positive infinity. And when we are going to positive, t goes to positive infinity. Values are close to pi over 2, to this asymptote, horizontal asymptote. So we can write this arc tangent goes to pi over 2, when t goes to positive infinity. So we have that this is equal square root of 2 over 8. We have in brackets pi over 2 minus arc tangent of square root of 2 over 2. This is my solution. And now, because we got finite number, it means our original integral, which we have at the beginning, is convergent.